They will fear the wild. All right, what is up? What is going on, guys? It's your boy Chumbles, and I'm back. And this time, we are playing some Volibear top lane. And a champion that I think I've not mastered, but um, I think I have the basically best build down for Volibear. And that is using this rune set here. Um, all works pretty efficiently. I will say that you can switch Alacrity for, um, you can switch Alacrity for Tenacity if you want, but other than that, I wouldn't switch anything else. Everything else works really, really well with this champion. Pretty insane that I haven't seen people actually run Grasp as much, but anyways, uh, that's besides the point, I guess. So, my build is going Frozen Mallet into Black Cleaver, and then the third item is dependent on what you're against and uh, just how the team's going and how the game's going. So, sometimes, like this game, AP, I'm going to go Wits End as my third item, but you could also go for a Blade of the Rune King, which is just a really good item in general. So, uh, yeah, a few options that you can go, and um, I think it's it's the best kind of way to play the champion. You do need CDR, Black Cleaver works really well on the champion. Uh, you don't win that, anyways, even if Swain doesn't go there, but yeah. Yeah, you don't want that anyways. <laughs> Alright. And now, we go in for some claw damage there. Alright. We, we kill him. Because people don't know that I'm the Volley Bear God. Oof. Damn. Alright. We're gonna auto this. We're gonna E. Flash stun. Ah. Uh, he didn't even go on me. Dang. <laughs> we were going for that, uh... That hyphy play there, but... Unfortunately couldn't get that... That next one. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, what the? Alright, we're just gonna head back. Wait. Oh my god, as if that didn't hit. Dang. I don't know if it would've killed them. It would've been kinda close. Oh, you might want to run, buddy. <laughs> this game, dude. Too funny. Alright, it's going to push back towards us, because there's only three minions here. So, it can't freeze. So, now, we grab Frozen Mallet. Or, we're going to build into it, but... Always grab the... Jarm's fist first because of the bonus stats that it gives uh, per minion kill. So killing a unit gives five extra HP on it, which stacks 20 times, so it's actually quite efficient. So yeah, definitely grab that first. Also, the AD can definitely help you in trades. So, yes. Yeah. I uh, don't know where he's at. So what a lot of people don't realize is his E applies on hit effects, which is why going Black Cleaver and the um, Frozen Mallet is really good because then both just apply right away. Oh man. 
The only bad part about Volley Bear is ranged matchups like this. I was hoping I could have got my Q off before. But you can run them down, which is kind of the saving grace, I guess. I'm going to go in once I have five stacks here. Get this done. Okay. I think one more combo and we can kill him, maybe. Actually, maybe not. We're getting too low. From the stupid minions. I'm also kind of scared of him healing up with his passive, uh, passive ulti. Okay. Well, we're gonna try, because I have bite. Damn. We're getting him really low, but... Not low enough. Not through that healing. We might have to actually pick up Executioners just because of this matchup. So we'll, uh, we'll adapt to what we're against here. Uh, he... Wait, did he already use TP? No, I don't think he did. He's probably gonna try and TP behind me, maybe? Or not. Or not. Uh, I don't want to lose cannon XP. Okay. So our max is going to be E into Q. I've Or er, W into Q. I've seen people take E, which I don't understand. I think E is uh, quite terrible on this champion. It's, uh, it's slow. And it just it doesn't work that well. Gotta say, um, I'm not gonna TP there because he will jump on me. Let's grab a refillable though. I don't usually grab this. In most matchups, I don't need it, but for ranged, I'm going to. And he has like Dorn's Blade and like dumb stuff like that, so. We'll, uh, we'll adapt to this game, but we're still gonna keep the core of Frozen Mallet into uh, Black Cleaver and Wit's End. I could go Wit's End second, actually. Wouldn't be too bad. But Frozen Mallet for sure. This champion needs Frozen Mallet 100%. If you don't go Frozen Mallet, you're kind of trolling, to be honest. Like, if I have Frozen Mallet here, it just makes this trade pattern insane. Like, he would not even be close to his... Uh, he wouldn't even be close to turret there. Okay, that's uh, not worth at all for me, trading a one for one, but whatever, I can't really stop him from inting my lane, we're just going to keep doing us and uh, push this in, always use your Q on tower if you don't need it to escape, it does, uh, I think it does about double your attack damage early on, so, yeah, really, really good. Then we're gonna bash into it there. We're gonna clear this. We're just gonna clear all this CS and then we'll head back. Ah, uh, was hoping I could get that. I got a few platings there, so that's pretty good. <clears throat> Alright, now we're gonna grab this. Could grab, uh, or I'm going to grab boots, but I could have grabbed full Merc Treads if I wanted. But I don't think it's necessary. Not right now. Especially since I go Q Max second. And, uh, we'll see if we can run them down here, hopefully. We got something big there. It wasn't items, it was actually our runes. 
So, like I mentioned, these are the best runes to take. And it's because we get a conditioning right here. So, now we have 13 armor and 12 magic resist, both for free. And the reason why that is so needed compared to whatever else is in that tree is due to the fact that um, Volibear, at least with the build that I go, stacks a lot of HP and you don't get too many resistances, which uh, can definitely be a bad thing. So... With that being said, you definitely want this, because it synergizes, like, health per uh, armor and all that, and magic resist. They all synergize together. Oh, okay. We're about to fly in here, baby. Oh my god, are you serious? She has literally everything up. Nice. Nice, dude. We like that. We like that a lot. Took a take a chunk out of them there. All right, well, uh, okay. I think he thought or he knew I was coming, so he tried to go for that. But yeah, that was unfortunate. She had a thousand movement speed because Karma is a stupid champion. And uh, she still had flash, so that's awesome. But we're gonna take we're gonna take top here, since I th think Swain has gone back. And boom. Okay. Took a little bite out of them. Keep people go away. Oh, no way. Alright. We got the chunk. That was actually a uh, not so bad trade for us there. Oh, and there goes Zalti. Nice. Okay. We're going to push this in. Are you serious? Are you serious? But you can see the power of this champion. It's like... I literally haven't gone back in a while. We get uh, First Blood Tower into a ranged matchup with Swain. We uh, fail mid lane with Flash Ulti, which ended up costing us kill top. But you can definitely see the power of this champion when played right. And, uh, I'm gonna go Swifties, actually. Uh, I'm not worried about their tenacity this game. So yeah, we're gonna go into Black Cleaver now. We have Frozen Mallet. Now you guys are gonna see if he still keeps coming top lane. You guys are gonna see how insane this item is on this champion. I swear I'm not memeing. Frozen Mallet on Volibear is 100% core. And if you're not buying this, you're trolling. I quite honestly believe that. 
Yeah, this guy's dead. If he's if he stays for these minions here, he's dead. 100% he's dead. Yep, he's gone. <laughs> he's a goner. He's a goner, boys. <laughs> oh man, he was literally not able to do anything. Oh my god. That's just so brutal. It's so gross how good this champion is if you actually know how to build him properly. I've seen so many bad builds, like people going Sunfire and I'm like... Why is nobody building Frozen Mallet on this champion? For one, the on-hit effect with your W. For the other, this champion has an insane Q ability, but has nothing to follow it up with, being that the rest of his uh, kit doesn't provide any more CC, which this champion very much needs. So... Yeah, I was like, pretty sure everyone's trolling if they're not getting Frozen Mallet. I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna try Frozen Mallet top lane. And I tried it, and I was like, yeah, this is broken, dude. <laughs> I literally haven't lost a game with Volley Bear doing this build. So, uh, I'm just gonna confirm that it's broken. And the insane part is how good the rest of your items end up being on this champion as well. Because getting a Black Cleaver with the passive stacking is just incredible. And the reason why it says E sucks is because it takes too long to hit. And it's just not reliable. That's the big problem with it. It's not reliable enough to, uh, to use. The damage is okay. Um, the shield's obviously nice, of course. I'm not going here just because I don't have ulti. <clears throat> so I'm just going to ping it before. Just in case people start getting upset being like, why didn't you come or something. Um, I think we could kill this guy. Okay, maybe not. Because we have Cuck Lord Karma coming in. Wait, what? Oh my god, that still killed me, damn. I was hoping, uh... My, uh... My Felix was gonna do enough damage there. Dang it. We still basically 1v2, though. And the Karma's fed, so... It's not like, uh... It's not like she was a useless support or something. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's bad. <laughs> yeah, that's real bad. Oofed. Alright, well, we have uh, Black Cleaver coming up soon. It's going to be very, very good. Can we run this guy down? I think we can. Nope. Shivana doesn't want to come for some reason. Cool. Alright, yeah, we win this. 100%. <clears throat> nice, good job. And I knew we won that just because the Shivana's fed, so... <laughs> I just had to press, uh, press Q there, and we should be fine. And we won, so that's good. Alright, I have ulti. This is our tower 100%. If 
anybody would like to walk up, they, uh, they'll get hit with the claws, baby. Alright, let's head top lane. I'm not really scared of the rest of their champions, but I do think I still need what's in this game. The uh, the healing will be really nice too. Also, doing these camps is really nice because you just munch them, munch them twice. Do we want to do this? I do have alts. Alright, we're, we're running back this way. <laughs> Boom! Oh, he got the jump in. Yo, what up, baby? We got the frozen mallet. What you gonna do? That's what I'm talking about, dude. The slows are just insane. We, uh, we basically Goomba stomped that, uh, that Yasuo, or we would've if he didn't have the, the ulti in there. But yeah, that's gonna be the game. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure to play Volibear the right way. The Chumbles way. And, uh, if you guys do enjoy and all that, I would appreciate if you guys could hit the like button. Comment down below and subscribe if you're new to the channel. We still have the giveaway going on, so make sure you do that. And uh, hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. So athletic, I've been up since six, making hits like tennis. I've been on fire, I just need my credit. Wanna go far, need to change my settings. Reaching for the stars on so my feet, touch heaven. I've been head first, bitch, already want seconds. Wanna be on top, popping off like a fofo. -fo. Life been going fast, I've been trying not to go slow. I just hit the gas, now I'm faded, going slow mo. You think you gon' pass, but you tripping, that's a no go.